My name is Alistair Neil from Southside of Glasgow. I'm 23 years old and I'm the Youth Development Coordinator with Active East. I'm Chloe Lawson and I'm an Active Champion with Active East. Active East is a programme based in the East End of Glasgow and it's been running for seven years now. It's set up originally as a Commonwealth Games legacy project. It had three sort of main aims at the start. It was for increasing partnership working. It was to increase aspirations of young people in the East End of Glasgow and increase physical activity levels. Today's event is an Easter event that was run by myself and other active champions in order to get young people out and keeping them active during Easter holidays without having to have a cost involved. So an active champion is a young person that has an interest in sport, physical activity, youth work, working with young people, anything sort of young person related that wants to volunteer at a local youth hub or sport organisation or anywhere they want to volunteer. They do training, national training with us, they are then out there sort of designing how they want their volunteer experience to look. So they pick what training they want to do, they pick where they want to volunteer, they pick how they want to volunteer, whether that's leading or assisting, or we've now got many mentors as well that are helping the, the younger active champions through starting up their journey. Activist has helped me in a lot of ways, so I've helped me with my confidence, I've helped me with taking responsibility, developing my own leading skills and give me an idea of what I want to do in the future. So I think it's very important for young people to take the lead, especially with this year being the year of young people. I think it's really put a, a sort of a light on it that we should really be trying to do this more. Um, at SSF we, we do try and do this. Everything we do is revolve around young people. We had awards night at the start of the year, they were helping planning that. Young people delivered that awards night as well. This event today they completely took the lead on it. I was sort of a bystander and they sort of Ran, ran wild with it and that's why we've got things like blood pools and bouncy castles and all that. So I think it is very important, it gives them a voice, it lets them know they've been listened to, really gives them ownership of what they're doing and allows them to sort of find what, what they want to be doing, how they want to be doing it and it really lets them take free reign on things like that and it gives them confidence for the future and sort of puts them in the right direction. It's important to celebrate the year of young people to show adults across the world that young people should get to have a say, that they're responsible enough to do things like this and that they should have a platform for them to be able to um, voice their own opinions. It is important that this event is led by young people and for young people because it gives young people an experience of doing things like this. This obviously is amazing and we've got so many young people organising it and actually coming to participate. As well for the actual event side of it, it means we're not taking control, we don't know what young people want, we're asking them what do they want in their event, so they're then delivering us today. I think that's very important because if we came down here and put on what we thought we wanted, the young people that attend it might not enjoy it. I think all the, the Active Champions have done an amazing job. They've absolutely done amazing. Very proud of them and aye, they all deserve a massive pat on the back around the applause, but no, it's amazing as you can see here. It's brilliant, fantastic. Mm -hmm.